welcome to the enchanting world of Cogsworth, where the air is filled with the scent of roasted chestnuts and the laughter of children. The annual Halloween festival has transformed the town into a vibrant tapestry of colors and flickering lights. Steam-powered contraptions were in clank, casting playful shadows on the cobblestone paths. Join us as we delve into a tale of adventure and mystery, where the past whispers through the pages of forgotten legends. This is chapter one of our story, and it promises to be a journey filled with excitement and wonder. Stay tuned as we explore the secrets hidden within the town's library and the adventures that await our young heroes. In the heart of the bustling festival, Evelyn Thorne stood at the edge of the crowd. Her wild, curly auburn hair danced in the breeze, and her bright green eyes sparkled with excitement. Her patchwork vest was filled with whimsical gadgets, each one a testament to her inventive spirit. Beside her, Oliver Finch clutched a notebook filled with stories. His round glasses slipped down his nose, a reflection of his timid nature amidst the vibrant energy surrounding them. Lydia Graves, with her sharp blue eyes, felt the weight of her family's legacy pressing down on her. Meanwhile, Finn, with his mischievous grin and tousled hair, darted between stalls, collecting bits of adventure like treasures. Together, they were drawn by the flickering lights of the town's library, a place where the past whispered through dusty tomes. The library stood like a sentinel of knowledge, its towering walls and spire of books reaching towards the sky. As the children entered, the scent of old parchment enveloped them, and the sound of gears turning filled the air, creating a whimsical yet eerie atmosphere. Shadows danced along the shelves, hinting at secrets long forgotten. In the heart of the library, a dusty, ornate book caught Evelyn's eye. It seemed to pulse with energy, its cover adorned with intricate illustrations that hinted at the town's forgotten legends. As Evelyn opened the book, the pages whispered secrets, igniting their imaginations. But as the children read aloud, the atmosphere shifted, shadows flickered, and a chill crept through the air, wrapping around them like a shroud. A mix of excitement and trepidation filled their hearts, for they sensed that they had awakened something ancient and powerful. Hints of the book's darker nature emerged through the eerie illustrations, each page revealing tales of heroes and monsters, of triumphs and tragedies. The children felt a thrill of wonder, yet a shadow of fear loomed over them, a reminder that knowledge could be both a gift and a curse. As they stood there, the library seemed to breathe, its walls alive with the echoes of stories waiting to be told. Unbeknownst to them, the awakened evil lurked within the pages, ready to challenge their unity and resolve, setting the stage for the adventures that lay ahead. The library, with its secrets and mysteries, had become a place of both wonder and danger, a place where the past and present intertwined in a dance of shadows and light.